Good morning. I will strengthen thee. We read in Isaiah chapter 41 in verse 10. God has a strong reserve with which to discharge this engagement, for he is able to do all things. Believer, till thou canst drain dry the ocean of omnipotence, till thou canst break into pieces the towering mountains of almighty strength, thou never needest to fear. Think not that the strength of man shall ever be able to overcome the power of God. Whilst the earth's huge pillars stand, thou hast enough reason to abide firm in thy faith. The same God who directs the earth in its orbit, who feeds the burning furnace of the sun and trims the lamps of heaven, has promised to supply thee with daily strength. While he is able to uphold the universe, dream not that he will prove unable to fulfill his own promises. Remember what he did in the days of old, in the former generations. Remember how he spake, and it was done. How he commanded, and it stood fast. Shall he that created the world grow weary? He hangeth the world upon nothing. Shall he who doth this be unable to support his children? Shall he be unfaithful to his word for want of power? Who is it that restrains the tempest? He doth not ride upon the wings of the wind, and make the clouds his chariots, and hold the ocean in the hollow of his hand. How can he fail thee? When he has put such a faithful promise as this on record, wilt thou for a moment indulge the thought that he has outpromised himself, and gone beyond his power to fulfill? Ah, no, thou canst doubt no longer. O thou who art my God and my strength, I can believe that this promise shall be fulfilled. For the boundless reservoir of thy grace can never be exhausted, and the overflowing storehouse of thy strength can never be emptied by thy friends or rifled by thine enemies. Now let the feeble all be strong, and make Jehovah's arm their song.